my name is Brittany with Zoo Atlanta, and today we have a Zoo to You Invertebrates edition. So I've got Miss Sparkle Muffin here. She is one of our resident invertebrates, and that means that she does not have a backbone inside her body. Sparkle Muffin actually carries her skeleton on the outside. She's got an exoskeleton. It's a hard shell that holds her body shape and protects her in her environment. Now Sparkle Muffin is a Chilean rose-haired tarantula, so she is an arachnid. That means she's got eight legs. She's gonna breathe with something sometimes called book lungs. And she's got this lovely set of spinnerets, which she's gonna show off for you right now. Those spinnerets she's gonna use to build her web. One of the roles that invertebrates often play in their ecosystem, especially if you're looking at an insect or an arachnid, is that they are kind of like nature's pest control. So they help make sure that other insects, and in Sparkle Muffin's case, could be frogs or mice as well, don't get to be too high such that they're causing damage in their ecosystem by there being too many of them. Now she's also got these lovely hairs. So a lot of tarantulas look like they're furry and those hairs serve different purposes. Some of them are helping her sense what's going on in her environment. Some of them are gonna help her cling on as well as her little toe hooks that are gonna help her cling to her surfaces. And then some of them she can actually use to defend herself by flicking them off of her body if an animal gets a little too nosy and those hairs will irritate that animal and hopefully make them go away so that Miss Sparkle Muffin doesn't become prey herself. That's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in to Zoo to You Invertebrates Edition. Please, if you are looking for any more at-home resources, check out our Learn page at zooalana.org and stay connected with us on social media using hashtag OnlyZooATL.